story time. You all already know, I've been talking a lot about mommy support. So as a part of our D-Day, my husband and I decided that he would take care of school drop-off in the morning and I would be responsible for getting our daughter ready. Well, this morning I was just really, really tired and he looked at me and he said, babe, listen, I'll take care of getting, you know, my daughter, our daughter ready. No problem. I'll take care of it. My first mind was, mm, I always do it and I kind of have my little rhythm and my routine and although I'm tired, I can just like, I'll just do it, don't worry. I so the Holy Spirit got me together and I started to remember and started saying, hey, I need to practice what I preach. What do I know to do in these moments? He's offered to help me and I clearly need the support. I said, babe, you know what? Please, yes, go ahead and do it. I'll just have everything ready for you and then you can just get her ready and just be done with it. So I found myself, y'all, <laughs> after we had that agreement, came to the agreement, I found myself literally like, you ever had like that little thing that's just on the back of your neck, like like annoying you? I kind of felt that vibe of me doing that to my husband. I kept popping up in the kitchen. Hey, babe, so when you do this, do it like this. Popping up when he's in the bathroom brushing his teeth. Hey, babe, listen, let me tell you. So listen, when she wakes up, you got to do it like this. And so I come to him, last thing, he's in the closet getting his clothes ready. And I come to him, I said, okay, babe, listen, last thing I want to tell you, this is what you need to do when you do. He said, you know what? I kind of feel like you're causing me to tense up the more you keep telling me I, what I need to do. Like, I need you just to let me do it. And I was like, I said, oh, I said, babe, thank you for telling me. You're right. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry. Thank you so much for stepping up. Thank you for letting me know. You're right. Let me step to the side. Go have my coffee. Sit down and take a breather. Don't you know? I sat down, did my thing. The brother got her ready in like 15 minutes. It typically takes me like 30 minutes. The point is I needed to get out of the way. I needed to accept the help that was offered to me when I needed it. Okay. I needed to step to the side and let him help in his own way. He knows how to get her ready. I had everything in there. Her undies, her outfit, everything was there. He just had to like literally get her together. And I was in there like, well, you need to do this. Popping up here, popping up there. I'm like, girl, sit your little self down. Talk about it before to let your husband help you in his own way. And I'm sharing this story to let you know that this is something that we have to continually remind ourselves of. We, we, nobody's perfect. You're going to have moments where you're like, okay, okay. I know, yes, I need to let my husband, I need to let him help me, okay, but you know, I kind of know how to do it better, so I'm just going to do it, okay, no, I'm going to let it go, I'm going to let him help me, but I'm going to tell him how to do it, exactly how I do it, because I need him to do it my way, but girl, let me tell you, after all that happened, after I got myself together and said, babe, thank you for getting me together, I think the new agreement needs to be that you're going to help get her get her ready on some of these mornings, and he was like, say no more, fam, so we have to continually practice these things, okay, so anyway, I'm over here getting myself together. <laughs> I love you guys for real. Don't forget, click the link in my bio. I did create a totally fun freebie. It is the mommy support cheat sheet, five steps so that you can start to create your own D-Day and start to finally get the support that you desire from your husband. Go ahead and click the link in the bio. It is attached to this week's blog post. You don't want to miss it. The D-Day cheat sheet is just for you. And I cannot wait to catch you guys in my next video. Bye, y'all.